This is Nate from Tumbleweed Fly and Tackle, and this is your Blue Water Lake update for October 20th through the 26th. The weather on Friday is supposed to be really windy, uh, high of 70. After that, that's a cold front pushing through, so we'll see high 50s on Saturday, and then it'll get into the mid to high 60s the rest of the week. Not a whole lot of wind, but last week, oh my Beautiful. gosh, all week. no wind. Yeah. It was awesome. You missed out. Fishing, <laughs> fishing was good last week and the week before, so it was. Yeah, you, you got that going for you. Yeah, last week, we, well, we we spent a few days out there uh, last week and caught some fish, and it's been pretty exciting. The mornings have been popping. Next week, I think it'll be the afternoons, or this this week, uh, it'll be the afternoons that are that are popping because it's it's going to be cold, and you want to fish that kind of warmer time during the day. Them fly guys have been putting the screws to me this week, yes. right? Just, and it's kind of cool seeing all the fly fishermen come back out. And uh, thanks for you guys' support. Yes. Evangeline ties a mean dirt. Um, so last Tuesday, we got a incidental stocking of 700 trout. Um, they were supposed to go to McGaffey and the stock truck ended up stopping here at Blue Water. Um, Bad conditions at McGaffey to stock. That 700 trout is not part of the three to 6,000 trout that we're supposed to get every month starting November through March. So this is just an accidental dumping of yeah. trout. Yeah. So if you're, coming out, on purpose. If yeah. you're coming out this weekend, uh, make sure you bring your trout tackle with you and see if you can't catch a few. I'll tell you that I did try to catch some trout on powered bait and uh, they were not having it. And uh, this other guy that was down there, one of Dave's buddies, Nick, I'm sure you've seen him some of the videos so far, uh, tied on this stupid little bug creature on a fly rod and caught one right next to me on his first cast. So they throw something buggy. Yeah. Because you know, the, the power bait thing isn't working really. <laughs> it, it's 700 fish in a lake that's a lot bigger than it normally is with predators in it. And uh, it's about a thousand acres right now so there's not find them, finding them is going to be very hard stick around the dock area because that's where they stocked them but there are so many minnows in that lake that these fish are going to get as soon as they get focused on those things we're not even going to see them anymore kind of same thing happened last year yeah and it, yeah there's billions but they did put some trout in here so if you do come out at least there's something else you might be able to catch if the muskies are on fire over the weekend. The oh. water temperature is anywhere from 55 to 57 degrees during the day. It's getting cold. We went out in the morning on Tuesday and it was like 52. So it's cold, but the fish are super aggressive. I mean, there was, a, in the morning we get a few follows. After about nine or 10 o'clock in the morning, they stopped following and they just ate. They're, they weren't thinking about it, they were just eating. So, Last week was pretty epic when it comes to, and it wasn't like, did I just get a hit? No, you're just like, oh, whoa. <laughs> just as a reminder or an early reminder, um, the park hours are going to change on November 1st. So the gate won't open until seven and it will start closing at five. So you'll be able to get out of the park after five. You just can't get back in. Yeah, it's So just be aware hours. of that. And our hours are also going to change too, to uh, kind of reflect that a little bit. So keep that in mind. We'll uh, probably keep gate hours this year. Yeah, we might we might go an hour over or something like that. But we like to get down there and fish <laughs> during this time of year too. So <laughs> well, this there's a two week window right now before the time changes when the gate closes at five, when there's still daylight in between yeah. five and the sunset. So sunset's about six six thirty next month and then they change the time and then it gets dark at five so <laughs> so you guys take it easy we'll see you out there on the water bye, bye.